heard of the caveman diet based on the wild plants and animals that were around during prehistoric times? Well, it's becoming more popular these days as many are turning to workouts like CrossFit that focus on a protein heavy diet. Well, now Portland has the first food cart in the region that caters toward the caveman enthusiasts. Cool. I'm going to try the chili. Dan Flood is a CrossFit enthusiast and follower of the caveman or paleolithic diet. You get a lot leaner, uh, a lot more um, muscular, uh, especially if you're coupling it with workouts and um, have a lot more energy. Dan and his colleagues came from downtown Portland to northeast Alberta to check out the cultured caveman food cart. The idea behind the paleo lifestyle is if the caveman didn't eat it, you shouldn't either. We just invented this technology called agriculture a few thousand years ago, but for millions of years before that, we were basically eating animal products and fruit and nuts and kind of stuff that you can hunt or gather. And those are the sort of foods you'll find at the Cultured Caveman, started by Joe Bond and Heather Hunter about two months ago. We kind of just assumed there would be one, um, so I Googled and there wasn't one in town, and that was in mid March. The two bought a food cart three days later and raised money through Kickstarter to launch their business. There's two schools of thought with the paleo diet. One's the more traditional Renaissance caveman approach. The other mixes health and nutrition and a more modern take. That's what they're doing here at the Cultured Caveman. You can see they've even got Grok here with his iPhone and his coffee. With menu items like bacon wrapped dates, grass fed all meat chili, and the paleo chocolate protein shake. The paleo diet is not without controversy. Some health experts say it's too high on fat and too low on carbs. But Joe and Heather and their growing fan base say they feel better after cutting out refined sugars and processed foods and getting back to the basics. I think this, the typical American diet is way too carbohydrate heavy, which is why we tend to go the other way and focus more on healthy fats and proteins because you can kind of get carbs anywhere and it's hard to get a good protein rich meal if you're really feeling hungry. You like that? Oh you my like that God, stuff? I love the mm -hmm. look of that. Chili looks delicious. Yeah. Is bacon? What is in those bacon things? Uh, dates, which I don't like mm -hmm. dates. I don't either. They were amazing. They're wrapped yeah. in bacon. They're probably pretty good. <laughs> probably. Hey, you can uh, find the Cultured Caveman <laughs> food cart at 14th and Northeast Alberta. It's in a pod of like three carts, and there's a little eating area in the back. You can also find them on Facebook. They, so there you go. The caveman cart. Something new yeah. to put on your calendar there. All right, coming up here still.